Hello, it's Tony here with this next video for your inspiration and motivation. How are you doing this week? I hope you're doing great. You're probably wondering why has Tony today got uh, the, uh, the puppet on the table? Well, as you're thinking about this date, the 21st of March, with Mike Hendricks and myself at the Freedom Family Workshop, you might have looked in the diary and thought to yourself, well, you know, the thing is though, if I do this, if I go to this event, it's something which just I'm going to go on my own. And I'm feeling a pull that maybe I ought to go this way or that way, the way that everybody else is going that day. So my friends, they were going shopping and those people over there, they're doing this. And I kind of get this pull that, you know, I'm, I'm being pulled by, by influence to go this way. When really I could just put aside a few hours on my day to really focus in on what it is that I want to free myself from. Let me tell you a quick story. I was speaking to a group of young people at a big seminar a few weeks back about all of these truths that we're going to share with you on the 21st. And at the end of the seminar, everybody clapped and they all left. And I did say at the end, if there's anybody who wants to come down to the front to ask about some good books to read or ask me some questions, I'm here. But everybody just left. They all left the uh, theatre and the door shut. So I tidied up all my props and my notes and then I noticed out of the corner of my eye that the door started to sort of open and then some little heads peeped around the corner and six people came in and stood in front of me and asked me questions and were holding on to every word and was so appreciative, it was, a, it was an amazing moment and we just talked and we shared and we inspired. And then I said something really powerful to those um, six people. I said, do you realise out of the 80 or so people that were sat in the theatre, you actually represent the percentage of that population that generally put aside the distractions, what the masses are doing, to focus in on what they truly wish to desire. And that takes courage. And you see, the trouble is, most of us on a daily basis, our strings are being pulled. All the time our strings are being pulled by outside influences. We're doing what they're saying, we're following what they're doing, we're doing what's trendy, we're doing what we feel is maybe the right thing to do. How often do we truly put ourselves on the spot and actually look within and, and just maybe cut these strings, these ties? So I explained that analogy to those uh, students that I was speaking to. It was the most amazing moment of connection and it was just great. So the message in today's video is this, if you see a hundred people walking in that direction and maybe one person walking in that direction with their ha head held high, maybe with a bit of a kick in their stride, I recommend you go and follow that one person because they're going to take you in a new direction. Go this way and you're probably going to just go the way that everybody else is going. There's a great saying, if you don't want fleas, don't sleep with the dog. I love that. If you don't want fleas, don't sleep with the dog. And what that means is, who are you spending time with? Who are you listening to? And I'll tell you one thing. In my big jump into the unknown after leaving full-time education, where I followed my heart, I had days, lonely days on my own. The, the best friends I had very often were books or just my own internal voice. But then also there was my good friend Mike Hendricks. And Mike is the most amazing person I have ever met in my life. He's an avid lifelong learner, but he's full of humility and authenticity. He changes people's lives just by speaking. It's incredible. He's wonderful. So I would run over and find wherever Mike was, if it was possible. Mike would sit down with me as a good friend, and he'd sort out a problem straight away by saying something very powerful, such as, is that thought serving you, Tony? Oh, you knew what to expect, you know, he'd always say something so, so wonderful. So I knew instantly that rather than following what the television was saying or reading the newspaper or just catastrophizing with all the chatter inside, I had a choice. You see, your greatest power is choice. I found Mike. I'd sit down with Mike and Mike inspired me. The power of being with somebody that's on that same wavelength. So, if you want to cut these strings, and you truly want to thrive and follow that dream, it takes courage, it takes huge courage, but it's better if you can surround yourself by the right people. That small minority, remember those six students I told you from 80 in total, find that minority, they'll be there somewhere, 
fact we will be there 21st of March at the Beef Eater Eden Stoops in Eden Leeds 2pm. We have a seat reserved for you because remember that day is going to change your life and Mike Hendricks and I will show you what that community feeling feels like to be around people that truly are thriving and we're going to reveal some amazing facts for you. I will see you in the next video. You have an awesome day. This is Tony Mallett signing out.